hi guys so it is the next day right now and i was supposed to work today but i had my period and i literally threw up because my cramps were so bad so i came home took a nap and i'm feeling a bit better now so i'm gonna go run some errands but i figured i would show you guys kind of like how i prep and prepare for a new semester because i just got an email that a ton of my syllabuses came out and i figured i'd show you guys how i do that and i also need to go to walmart and get a few school supplies so i figured i'd vlog that but i'm heading to the mall right now with emma i probably won't vlog too much i just need to get some last minute stuff for our trip next week because we leave in a week today <clears throat> um and i'll show you guys that stuff in my like prep with me for traveling vlog but i'm heading to the mall right now and i'll probably talk to you guys when i get back to the girls that could potentially date you it's four i just dropped emma off we went to the mall i got some stuff which you guys won't see until I film my like pack with me and prep with me for traveling video because it's all travel related. So I'm sorry about that, but I'm headed to the supplement store to get protein powder. I also need to go to, I need to go to Indigo to get a new pop socket because I don't have one on this phone because I got a new phone case and I just want a black one. And then I need to get groceries for lunches mainly just two days worth of groceries i don't need a lot because i have a lot of snacks at home the supplement store i'm gonna go to indigo and then i'm gonna go to walmart and then that's it so so i just got to the hospital i don't work but this is the gym i'm closest to and i really like our hospital gym it's really small i've shown you guys in vlogs before but it's always empty there's literally no one here and so i'm gonna come here it was like literally on my way home and i kind of want to wait out traffic a little bit anyways and then yeah like going to the gym in my part of town would have been out of the way because i have to go to the grocery store still so we're gonna go to the gym here i did back in legs yesterday and the days before that i did shoulders so i'm not really sure what i'm gonna do maybe arms maybe i'll do arms and abs because i did back legs shoulders i could do chest maybe i'll do i'm gonna do chest and buys and abs i think and then some cardio but that's my update and i'll talk to you guys after the gym i also need to get my nails done so bad look how grown out they are and I'm missing one. How ratchet, but okay, that's my update. I'll talk to you guys after. And I was at the nutrition store. I'm gonna do a haul when I get home about what I got, but I just got this energy drink because I wasn't in a pre-workout mood and I didn't realize we had bang in Canada now, but it's just a blue raz energy drink. So I'm gonna have this before I go to the gym instead of pre-workout. What time is it? 4.45. The gym and i was in there exactly an hour so that's good it's night time so i'm gonna head to the grocery store really quick i'll just do kind of like a little montage of me grabbing stuff so i won't do a grocery haul i don't really need much honestly i literally just need to get salad and chicken like egg whites that's literally it it's not exciting but i'm gonna do that really quick get a pop socket and then we're gonna head home because i have so much organizing and stuff i want to do and show you guys for the new semester because that's kind of the basis of this vlog I needed a lot of stuff <laughs> okay guys so i just got home from all my errands and crap you guys can tell that right there i'm gonna do a haul for you guys i feel like i haven't done one of those in so long and i got a decent amount of stuff i don't know i feel the need to like defend myself but i didn't go back friday shopping i didn't go boxing day shopping like i didn't buy myself anything in december because i just wanted to focus on presents i didn't buy myself anything so i worked 72 hours in the last seven days and you know, I got a good paycheck today and I decided to treat myself and there's nothing wrong with that. Actually, I spent like 120 bucks. I didn't spend a lot of money, but I'm gonna show you guys everything I got. Um, and I picked up code names because it's so fun. And then I also picked up new phone who dis, but I'm, I'm filming on it. Like I'll show you guys, but this is my little tripod because I lost mine, but it's kind of like, what do you mean? So fun. So I got that yesterday. I just got new makeup wipes. Y'all know I love the Walmart makeup wipes. They're the bomb. So I just got the two packets, like seven bucks for 120. Um, got some new cotton rounds and then just some school supplies. My favorite pens and my favorite pencils. 
so I just need new ones. I stocked up on that, which is kind of relevant to the video because it's like getting organized. Okay. Package from Lulu. I got a gift card for Christmas, so I didn't buy this, but things. I just got to do a scrunchie. It's just their like plain black scrunchie. I think it's called, yeah, it's called the Uplifting Scrunchie. So I got that. And then I just got these socks. These socks are life changing, and I only get them when they're on sale. So these are the Speed Sock. Um, they look like this. I really like the color. And basically, you guys can probably actually tell, but see how the back kind of comes up a bit more. They're amazing for running because you never get blisters or anything. Highly recommend these changed my life. So I got these because these were on clearance for like eight bucks, which is pretty good. So I got those in this pink color. What did I go? Oh, I went to the supplement store because we finally got a Lonnie new in Canada. And so I was super excited and I was like, okay, I'm going to get confetti cake because literally everyone talks about how good confetti cake is. But when I went, I got the Lonnie new whey protein and they were buy one, get one free. At first I thought it was buy one get one half off which I was like okay I should get a second one and then he was like oh it's buy one get one free and I was like I'm sorry what did you just say free? So I got a second one and I just got chocolate because I like to make chocolate banana peanut butter protein shake so I got these two for the price of $64 which is insane. I just got a new shaker. I just like the pink color because it says supplement queen on it and I thought that was so cute so I just got a new shaker. And then the last thing I got was this, which is a protein spread. I literally love Nutella so much. And the guy said this is amazing. So it's just the nuts and more um, cocoa hazelnut spread. And it has seven grams of protein for two tablespoons. So got that. I'll let you guys know how I like it. I got a new pop socket because my phone case is... Um, my phone case is black. And I wanted a black pop socket for it. Because the only pop socket I have is my buzz one which is on my clear case so i wanted to get just a black on black one so i got that that was 14.95 and then when we played this game last night at emma and rob's and it was so fun so i bought it because matt was saying he wants to get it so i got it for us and it's just called ramen fry it's a fun little game um i got a new book to read which i'm really excited about for the new year um i've seen so many people talk about this it's to hell with the hustle so I'm going to read that. I love having books to read on weekends at work because it's really slow. And then I just got myself a little notebook. Um, it was on sale for $4.50 and it's so cute. And I've just been really liking writing my to-do list in an actual notebook. So and I just thought that was nice. So got all that. I'm going to put all this stuff away. And then I'm going to talk to you guys about how I'm going to get organized for the new semester. I'm literally so excited hi guys okay i got new glasses i'm not sure how i think i'm not sure what i think about them yet but i do a brand deal with the company in a little bit so yeah let me know if you guys like them or not mine are just so scratched up that i need to take a break from them because like i can't even see them anymore so these are the ones we got for now but i figured we'd get to um how i'm gonna organize for the new semester so first thing we're gonna do is light a candle You can't talk. First thing I'm going to do is just put the new stuff I got in my pencil case. That way it's all ready to go. This is my planner. I did have a passion planner before, but eh, they got water on it and I just decided to go back with this one because the pages are thick. It's a happy planner. It's from Michaels. Um, you can get them for 40% off. I love the layout. So this is my January monthly layout. If you guys are wondering, I do any paydays and bills in green. Gray is any like traveling or fun things. So I have like a massage here. Um, and this is our Disney trip. I do Chio in pink, TOH in purple. Those are my two jobs. And then I put any classes in blue. I haven't done any exams yet, but when I do put them in, they'll be in yellow. Then this is what a month the weekly spread looks like, which I'm obsessed with. So you have everything on this side. Um, so I just make myself like mini to-do list during the day. And then I just kind of put different things down here. So I had payday this week, so I just kind of sorted out my payday. Um, and then the one for next week has like trip to do stuff. And then it has errands you need to do, projects, which for me is YouTube videos, calls and emails, and then just it says appointments, but I change it to groceries. So that's kind of what it looks like for this. Um, but that's what my planner looks like. I'm gonna show you guys my like school website. This is what our thing looks like. We use Brightspace for this semester. So I guess if you guys are interested to know what classes I'm taking, I am taking aging here and elsewhere, which is a requirement for my gerontology minor. I'm taking a religion of the religions of the world class. I actually love religion classes. They're super easy and they're online, so they're like pretty much an A. The earth and how it works, thought that would be fun, and then two gerontology classes because I'm done all my psych prereqs. So I'm taking cognitive aging dementia and interventions with aging populations. So 
I don't know if you guys can, you probably can tell, but a ton of my like course outlines got posted today, which is awesome. So the first thing I do is I'm, I'm just going to pick a class. Let's just pick my sociology class and I open the outline and then I'm also going to open my Google calendar and then I'm just going to kind of like go through it quick. Um, I kind of go right to the assessment methods part where it kind of says like midterm, in-class activities, like weights of the class, and that's the first thing I'm going to put in. So I'm going to go through all my syllabuses and put dates in my calendar. I am going to go in with pencil first in my planner for um, like midterms and dates and stuff because... I just, I don't know, sometimes I drop a class and I don't keep it and then I am stuck with these like due dates. So I'm going to put it in pencil first, even though I have to keep this class because it's a requirement, but you know what I mean. Oh, and I need to buy a textbook. So I'm going to keep track of the fact that I have to buy textbooks. That's lovely. Okay, next. Okay, nothing's up there for that class. I think this class was posted. Perfect. Let's open her up. Oh, my syllabuses were only up for two classes, which is fine. We're still... It's today. Today's Friday, January 3rd, and classes don't start until Monday, which is the 6th. So I have time to get my other three syllabuses, and two of them are with profs I've taken so many classes with, so I'm not really worried about it. Um, so yeah, that's what I did there. So I'm just going to go through now and put those dates in pen because I need these two classes to graduate, so I can't drop them. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in pen with a yellow highlighter so that I see them 100% for sure. Now I'm just downloading my syllabi as well as my geography, my geology class has a lecture up. So I'm going to show you guys kind of how I organize everything. So this is my Google Drive. I'm sorry, it's winter 2020 semester. And then I have all my classes up here. So I'm going to go into my Earth and How It Works class and I'm going to drag. First of all, I'm going to make a new folder and I'm going to call it I'm gonna go like that. I'm just going to go up there and in that we're going to put in our two classes so there's an intro lecture and i like to change the names because i don't like the names they use so do that perfect the lectures are there and then i'm also just going to drag my syllabus into the general area so with that i'm probably going to head to bed i hope you guys enjoyed this i hope it was helpful at least um it's hard because i don't have a ton of stuff yet and i only have two classes available but i want to show you guys kind of how i get started and organized before a new semester so i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you did subscribe if you're not already and i'll, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video bye